All right, so the next thing we're going to do, let me go ahead and delete this slide, is to add a video element or asset. And actually by doing this, you're going to be learning how you can actually add the voiceovers that I've added to many of the slides. I will show you that again when I'm talking about adding voiceover, but you can create a video of yourself and make it look a little bit like this. This is how you do it. I'm going to create a new slide and I'm going to change the background to black. I actually showed you already how to apply to all and then I reverted back to white so I could show you from time to time how to change the background. I think uh, repetition is a good thing. So I'm going to close that out. You don't have to. I just wanted to clean up my screen. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to home and you'll see along the tabs here, there are these variety of options. I'm going to click slideshow. And in slideshow, you have a lot of options here. The option you're looking for is record slideshow. I'm going to click on that. When I click on that, it's going to open up this screen. And what you can actually do is move from slide to slide in the screen. Now, what you'll want to be attentive to is that when you hit record, if you've already done recordings, that you hit stop and not this key. Otherwise, it's going to want to record over a previous slide or the next slide or whatever it is that you're recording or however, however you move. So what I'm going to do, though, is I need to make sure that my camera is enabled. And you can see that you see me in the bottom corner here. And all I'm going to do is hit record and I'm going to keep talking. So hey everybody, this is Craig just showing you how to record. I'm gonna hit stop. And then what I can do is I can close this out by hitting escape or hitting the close button. You will actually see now I am at the bottom corner here, but we know that we want to center this. I'm gonna put it in the center. And then I can actually hit the control key and I can grab one of the sides and that'll keep it at scale. And I'm gonna scale up to where I want it and let's just say right there and boom I am done now the only thing is of course that there's probably some dead space so I'm gonna to go to trim I'm gonna take out any of the dead air space I can kinda of see on the screen where my voice starts I can do that on the back end as well click OK I'm gonna cancel that just so it doesn't take a processor speed and it would work now I want to also make sure that I right click or as I already taught you you can go up to playback and do it here but I'm gonna go ahead and change this to start automatically okay it is already set for that and now when I go to the slideshow you can see that it plays through so that's all you need to do there and yeah you have another element already on your slide deck